absolutely. Let's get those comments in on social media. But now it's time for us to get to know our celeb guest. Joining us on the couch today is female entrepreneur, artist and DJ, Karma Luna. But before we get to know her, let's take a look at the music video for her cover of the popular Take House song, Panic Room. Hell raising, hell raising, I'm ready for the world. So frightening, face whining, fear that you can't reverse. My phone has no signal, it's making my skin crawl, the silence is so loud. A so beautiful here. music video, girl. Thank I you. was in the feelings. That black and white vibe, you're looking amazing. I mean, Thank tell you. us a little bit about the music video. That was shot in lockdown in my apartment, like literally in my own panic room. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, so it was a home project, but it came out beautiful. So it it's amazing what you can do on an iPhone. It absolutely is incredible. It is spectacular. I see the creativity. I see the feeling. And that's kind of what I want to tap into today. I mean, you already have a spectacular name, Karma Luna. Can you tell us a little bit about the inspiration of the name and um, why you chose it? So, um, karma, I mean, I really do believe that what you put out there comes back to you and how you treat people is... So I really do believe in that principle of how you treat people, you will be treated as well, and I try to live by that principle. And then, um, Luna, I'm obsessed with the moon. It's, I've got it tattooed on my hand. I love a full moon. I love... It's just... It resonates me with me. So, Stunning. yeah, it's just a mix of the two names. Tell me a little bit about your sound. I mean, yes, we are celebrating International Strange Music, day your music isn't strange <laughs> however it does have a lot of feeling and a lot of depth to it can you just tell us about your sound um yeah so it basically goes with the same principle and um, music for me has been such a big part of my life of healing and I really wanted to heal other people through my music. So everything that I write, everything that I release is a representation of something I'm feeling. So I'm very connected with my music. Mm -hmm. And yeah, I'd always like, even the, the, not even just the lyrics, but the actual sound of the music um, resonates with exactly how it feels on the inside. So it's mm -hmm. kind of a, a melodic representation of my feelings as well. My goodness, girl, you better preach a melodic <laughs> representation of how I feel. Um, but you're not only an artist, Yes, no. of course. You've got a little bit of a Sasha Fierce vibe going on <laughs> where you live two worlds yes. in one. Yes. By day, you're a publicist within the, mu within the media space. And then, of course, by night, you're an artist, DJ, DJ, Kumnandi. <laughs> Can you tell us about the two worlds, how you are able to mesh the two and your time management must be crazy? <laughs> it is. I am on a calendar and it's so strict, my schedule. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, it's they're both in the entertainment and music industry, so that really, really helps. I'm so deeply passionate about both of them. Mm -hmm. So that, I think, really, really does help because I don't do anything I'm bitter about. I'm really... I get so excited to wake up every day. I've really curated a beautiful life. Mm -hmm. um, and, yeah, just really good time management, really good work ethic, mm -hmm. um, lots of to-do lists, lots of stationery, <laughs> lots of papers and writing and journaling and all of that. So, yeah, it's pretty much just trying to manage everything. And if that's not enough, you decided in the past year to also put DJ um, under your list of, of I suppose, uh, roles and responsibilities. Uh, you do also want to start incorporating some Afro beats into mm. your music, some Latin beats. Where do you want to see your music going? Yeah, I mean, I really... I believe in just living your life to the fullest and doing everything that you can and what, whatever your dreams are, see what happens and that's how you grow and learn. So that's why I took on the DJing. Mm. Um, so yeah, I just really, I've always loved Latin music. I've, I was a Latin dancer. So, and I really do find that Afro beats and the Afro sound has a similar vibe to it. Yeah. But it also comes back to my roots, which is African. So mm. it's really just, it comes out, it's so much more vibey. I feel like I'm in a really good place in my life and like, and that energy just represents that as well. So yeah, I'm going to be really, I'm working with some other producers featuring on some of their tracks that are Afro Beats and Latin House. So, mm. yeah, so that's where I'm going now. Now, you also <laughs> are very passionate about mental health. I mean, I can just see it in the way you speak about your music and the kind of message you wanted to have to your audiences. Um, where does the coaching, mental health, and, and I suppose life coaching kind of play in your life? So, um, I've been surrounded by people with mental health issues mm. um, and it's something I'm incredibly passionate about. I struggle with anxiety and PTSD. Mm. So, I just think that... Um, um, I really believe in people taking responsibility for their mental health, not not 
we're not always responsible for what happened to us, but we're responsible with how we deal with it. Mm. So um, get a good doctor. I mean, a lot of people have access to doctors or medication. Mm. I've been blessed enough to be um, have access to it. So yeah, just there's resources that are available and I just mm. want to do that as well. Like I'm, I'm studying life coaching at the moment mm. and just, I mean, helping friends, helping family, helping anybody that needs it. Just mm. a safe space to go and talk to someone. Mm -hmm. um, it's so important to have a good support system when you're struggling. And the world's tough at the moment, yeah. especially coming out of a pandemic, so. Yeah, well, it seems as if you're healing in the music, you're healing um, in the life coaching, and you're helping someone like me within the public, <laughs> pub publicity space. Yes. Oh, thank you so much, Karma, for coming through to thank Afternoon Express. Thank you for having space. me. But now we're gonna put your cooking skills to the test. Oh, here we go. <laughs> <laughs> Corporate by day and performer by night. Karma Luna is a great manifestation that your dreams and goals shouldn't just be limited by your day job. So go out there and live life that you believe you deserve.